Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are in Icarus. Um, this is a new series of Icarus. Um, I was running a series before my laptop crashed some time ago. Um, but to be honest, the first few videos of that series were terrible. Oh dear, it's dark. First things first. If you want to complete missions for the UDA, you'll need to craft a short range radio. Plenty of folks need help. And factions pay well for prospectors that offer their time. Up to you. Stay safe. Uh, yeah, as I was saying before I got rudely interrupted, I was um, originally, I did create a Icarus season, but the first few videos, it was the first few videos I made since coming back to YouTube, and they were appalling. I didn't have the settings right on uh, OBS, and um, the videos were terrible. So uh, I've abandoned that one, to be honest, and I haven't played in such a long time. Uh, I've decided to start a new series again on Olympus um, in the north-west corner. Um, so let's get going. For those of you who have never played Icarus, it is a craft and survival game. I'm just trying to remember the keys now. F, that's the one. F to pick things up. Um, you need to start with nothing, literally with nothing. Um, inventory, yeah, you see, that's all I've picked up, that's all I've got. And build from there. And as you do so, you um, you, you, you learn tech, or you, you gain experience, top left, to uh, get tech. Um, not unlock tech. So what I need to do to begin with is I need to get to like a stone age, which is literally getting a few sticks, like such. What was that? There are bears and wolves in this game, by the way. Uh, at this location, anyway. And yeah, at this point, they, they will just kill me so quickly. It's unbelievable. Um, so yeah, I need a few more stones. I'm looking for stones. So I need some stones like this. And berries. Berries, I can um, consume some. And they give me a little boost. Um stones stones f I remember it's f play too many games too many key combinations that sounds like a chamois which is like a goat that's something over there now you do actually see the um go oh, some water mounts here i'll not take them all i just want some to get a boost again these things help boost your stamina recovery oh, your stamina your stamina recovery right let's go to crafting can i craft a axe yet yeah, let's get that done. What's that? Contains cool water. I've got no idea what that is. Um, that's obviously changed since I've played before. How do I craft that? What do I need? Water treatment pill. I haven't got a water treatment pill. What are you on about? Okay. And a pickaxe. So that's a new one to me, by the way. I don't know what that is. Um, yeah, I did know about them. I haven't got any honey, but I do have seeds. Honey you get from bees. Um, this game's always evolving. It is also made by Rocketworks, the company behind Stationeers, which is the other series I tend to run. Um, they actively develop both, you know, all the time. And I think it's one where we get 130 update. So this has been out nearly, well, it's been out 130 months effectively. The 130 weeks, sorry, not months. They do an update every week uh, to add something, to fix something. So yeah, it, it, they're good like that. So yeah, we're just going to keep running around, grabbing bits. Now I've got a pickaxe. I can come up with these stones. And mine some stone. What I really need to do is try and find some water. Alright, my stomach's depleting, so I've stopped before I get too low. Right, where am I? Okay, so some water over there, water over there. Oh, no, I'm in the southwest, southeast corner, sorry. I did, I picked the other side. This is a uh, um, kind of very basic area. Okay, so there's water to the north of me. And water to the south east, southwest. Which way do I want to go? That way, I think. Let's go towards that lake. Um, the other thing it is, you can't breathe the atmosphere. You are wearing an environmental suit. 
Um, so you do have to look after your water consumption and this blue stuff I'm picking up is oxide. It allows you to produce oxygen, um, which you need to be able to stay alive. So at the bottom you've got, bottom left you have, uh, they leveled up there, you have um, the plus of the like, chill icon and the hot icon for your temperature. Um, above that you have your health and above that you have any buffs that you've got. Um, to the right of that you've got O2 which is your oxygen and to recover oxygen you can stick O2 into one of the pockets in your, your suit and it'll slowly replenish your oxygen but it'll burn through that quite quickly. That's the starting of how to do it. Later on you get uh, tanks and things you can use to extend your range of your oxygen and make it last longer. Um, you've also got to keep yourself hydrated which is a little drop icon and um, full of food, um, not hungry, which is the uh, knife and fork icon. So that's what you've got to work with to begin with. Uh, there's quite a few foods in this game. This is uh, off your pumpkin, which you can roast on the fire. I'm not going to pick it up for now. I will pick up some more of those. I will pick up some more oxide, right? Which way is it going? Southwest, I think I said, didn't I? Yes, this way. Um, there's a good chance I'm going to run into something here, so let me see, can I build a spear yet? No, but I do have some tech points to spend. Uh, I want that, I want that. That's a repair knife, don't really want that at the moment. Um, could do with that. And I'm going to, oh, I've got enough points to get that, okay. Good, so what do I need to make a... Crafting. Well, it's going to be talents first. So you have talent point, talent point to spend as well, which allow you to buff things up. So I typically go for things that boost your stamina, your health, um, to begin with. So um, increase base stamina. Stamina is one that is forever depleting, and you have both personal or normal talents and solo talents. You get solo talents. I think it is like every other level. Again, the first people are playing solo that I am now. Uh, what's that down there? Yeah, but it's a rich world, this one has lots in it. And food does decay in your backpack, by the way. Um, as that green bar hits the bottom, you get one wasted food. Same with that one. Um, anyway, I'm crafting, crafting, crafting. I want to craft a spear. I want to craft a bow. And I want to craft a knife. And craft as many... Oh, maybe let's go for 15. Arrows as we can. And four. There we go. So there's a rabbit there. Let's see if we can get him. Oh, missed him. How did I miss him? He stood still. There we go, we got him. Get our arrow back. And using our knife, harvest him. If you leave dead animals around, they will draw in other animals that are carnivores. So wolves and um, things like that. Right, which way is it going? Southwest, this way it's heading. There's some wheat, that's always good to have. You can make, as you unlock things, you can make a uh, flatbread with it, which is quite a good bonus. It also gives you um, quite a few help, experience points for a little effort, because there's lots of wheat to pick up. It's all in one place, so you can get quite a bit of experience just by doing it very early on in the game anyway. So let's keep heading down. Shit, what's that? There we go. There's a wolf. Oh, where's the spear? Come here. If you can get them in the head, you can do more damage. So he's taking me down by half health. Boy, am I glad I created a spear and everything. I need the bones. 
Right, um, how far am I from that water? Not far. There's another rabbit. I don't want to strum down with a spear or not. Oh, I can. That was lucky. Oh. What I'm looking for. That's a chamois and a deer. I'm after hides, really. Um, I need the hides soon to make a bed. Right, let's just keep going this way. I want to head towards the water. How's my inventory doing? Okay. Oh, crap. It took too long aiming. I should have gone for it. You can get a headshot and I can't see you. You can, a lot of the time, you just kill him outright. But uh, he saw me. So here we are, down by the river. What I'd like to do is get onto that island. There are also fish in this um, game. There's none here. Um, you can sit in the water a long time because you've got an oxygen mask on, effectively. Um, as there are poisonous fish, there are also crocodiles, which uh, like to take big lumps out of you. Um, I guess the Tyrannus are in this area. Tyrannus are a as a fish that's on the poisonous fish, um, like a, a, a terror horse I call them. <laughs> they um, they like to take big lumps out of you too. Cross between, I don't know, a unicorn, well, not maybe a unicorn, but a, but a horse and I don't know, maybe it was a lion or something like that. There's plenty of oxide here, there's plenty of berries here. Keep harvesting. And when it gets dark in this game, it gets really dark. You don't get to see a lot, I'm just trying to get my level up. That's one of my foods just out. Woo woo! Was one of my foods expiring. So I go back in, consume another one. Come on, I'm nearly up a level. It's these little trees you can take down with just uh, the F key. Big trees like this, you need a axe. Hit them a few times, they'll fall over. Like so, you've got to be careful don't fall on you. And then you've got to come up to them and chop them up. And then they break up into wooden slats like that. I'll see if you can do it like that. There we go. One of the wooden slats, see if you can pick them up. So I've just gone up another level. Um, what time of day is it? Time of day is with uh, where's the time of day on here? I can't remember. Do, do, oh, just underneath the top right hand side, you've got like a little bar with three yellow things and two green things. That's the weather for the next five, three to five days. And then underneath that, you've got the, the time. So it's just gone midday. So I've got plenty of time yet. It's here, so it will get dark soon before I know it. So I need to be prepared. Which means I need to find somewhere to build. And I think here will do. And I like to build close to or on water initially. I am actually on an island here, I think. Yeah, I am on Money Island. Good. So, uh,. I am protected a bit. You see, there's lots of wolves and uh, bears roaming around here, but they tend not to come onto the island too much. I must say never, because I have come across them on the island, but not as bad as being on the mainland. Um, right. Tech tree. So I want to. And come. On. If you hold the right mouse and drag you can drag this bar left and right you need level 10 before you can open tier 2 level 20 for tier 3 and level 40 sorry 30 for tier 4 
Um, I want to be able to build wood or corner pieces. Um, dirt mound, a place to plant crops, okay. A simple block of dirt that can serve as a foundation of a structure must be placed attached to the terrain. Oh, do you have to place ground terrain now, do you? Dirt foundations. Requires 20 dirt. Well, I'm going to need dirt, so I can't do that at the moment. Stone cans. Let's have a look at that one. Um, there's some... I've got one point left. There's some um, two uh, armor here. I don't want that at the moment. What I'm looking for is a fire. I'm unlocking the fire. I can cook the, the meat I've got. That then allows me to also, when I go up level, unlock the bed. Uh, talent points. Again, I just want to try and increase my stamina. I have a solo point this time. And again, it's all on um, stamina. Heavy lifter. Uh, health, increased base health. Sorry, that one. Right, what's that? Oh, spoil plant. So that was food that has gone off. Right, so I need to. What's that say? Uh, sticks. I don't that little icon in the bottom corner of them. Never mind. Um, I need to. 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 to oh, I've still got tongue points left. Oh, I've got no tongue point left. Well, that's interesting. I'll take two stamina. Alright, I want to start crafting a wood pile. We're going to fill that. Reason being, I've got nothing in my inventory. No space in my inventory. And I can. Oop, I don't want to do that. I can now take this down, press 6, and place it on the ground. And then to get that, I just press um, F to pick it up. Um, at the bottom there you can see a red bar, oh, you could see a red bar and a yellow bar. Um, the top one is how much weight I'm carrying towards my limit, which is currently 100 kilograms. And the bottom one is um, how many slots, I've got 24 or 24 slots filled. So right, I want to destroy that. Let's just destroy that, I don't need that. Destroy. I want to create some foundations now that I have um, unlocked wood. So I'm going to place only one each corner. Okay. Okay, we'll craft three then. What don't I need here? Well, you can go down there. I need that wood. So let me just pick it back up again. Um, yeah, yeah, he. At three, I need at least another three to make the most basic two by one um, building. So that needs two flooring, two ceiling, and it will need one, two, three, four, five walls. Okay, let's just create as many as we can. And here, things running around me. Oh, it's another rabbit. Right, base. I have the um, wooden beams in my inventory, slot 6. Select that so I can place them anywhere at this point. Once I place them, it will lock them into a frame, into a grid pattern. So that one there, and now it's in a grid. So I can go like this. Come on. Stop being silly buggers. It can be a bit finicky sometimes to place them. There we go. Um, I need to fix my knife because see that's, that's just damage on the bottom here. You see some of these are taking damage. The knife damages quite quickly. What's that? Animal feed. Don't need to worry about that. I created two flooring. Let's bring them down. Uh, six as well. Make sure they're both the same way because they're nothing more annoying than flooring in separate ways. Okay, and then a wall. I thought I created a wall. No, I hadn't. Okay. I need to chop down more trees. I think it's trees I need. Yeah, it's wood. Whoa, get out of the way. That poor hit me.
Well, I'm picking everything up. Obviously, my inventory is quite full at the moment. I just need to, you know, get to a point where um, I can start making chests that store stuff in. I think we've heard all of that tree by now. Alright, let's stick there. Alright, let's build how many walls we can build. Craft. There we go there, number eight. So let's. So when you go to place something, if you press and hold R, you get this radial menu up and you can pick what you want. So I would like a window on this side. So I select the window. There's a storm coming in. And I'll have another window on this side. Come on, place it. Then this one in the back. I just want a, um, straight walls. And if you notice, there's an arrow pointing out. That You can switch that, but pointing out what you want. Because um, then you have the inside facing in. And the outside facing out. Like so, Oh, I want to create another wall. I forgot. I've got... No, not max. Just craft one. And then I can craft a door. So eight. Oh, door frame. As you see, it's raining, and this, this I will get damage ultimately from a storm exposure. So if I stay out in the rain too long, I will take damage. So I've just now building myself a little shelter. Uh, six for new roof. It's flooring, but it's also roofing, if you get what I mean. So there we go, we've got a little cubby hole, and now the door. Put that the number six, pick it. And there we go, and just press F to open it. And I can see out each way, and you know, I can look out. Um, I can't light a fire at this precise time because. Which I actually build a fire in here, I think. Can I build a fire in here? Or will it burn down? Your buildings do burn down as well, if you're not careful. And you can set yourself alight. Right, let's put that. Don't know if the ground, the stone fire, burns down your building or not. I can't remember. Uh, these are the various fuels you can use. I've got some wood on me, so um, I'm just going to use that. And then I've got meat here, I can put that into the fire, and that will now cook. I can also get anything else here I can cook. Normal meat, there we go. Um, and you can also store things in the fire, believe it or not, so let's stick that in there. That will do, my water's very low. I need to go and take a drink of water. There's a chance I may get poisoned by this. I didn't. So I was lucky that time. Close the door. You do get windows later on. Keep an eye on the fire, so we've got some cooked meat there. Bring that across, right click, consume, and it gives me a chunk of food. Uh, hunger back. If I'm damaged, it'll also re recover some of the damage. So there's not really a lot I can do other than keep nicking out every now and then to clear some bits. And earn some XP. This is just a starting base. I will be um, likely moving off this island to find a better location. But just to normally quite a safe spot to start. Just run around, getting bits. How are we doing? Um, I could always mine some stone. That's quite good for XP. You see when it's in shadow it's really difficult to see. Stamina depleted. 
I'm um, also taking storm damage at the top there, you can see uh, it is storm exposed, just come back inside, shut the door, and that goes down quite quickly. And um, we've got more cooked meat there, let's bring that over. <coughs> Eat the melon to get the bonus for that. its last piece of meat cooking. Bring that down. Actually I'll leave that in the fire but then I will deactivate the fire to save the wood. Right hopefully the worst of storms over. Yeah it is. So I can go back out and um, just mine a bit more to try and get my XP up. Time of day, uh, rabbit. I need your little rabbit. Sorry, I need your fur. Where is he? There he is. Yeah, I need the fur, unfortunately, because I think I need. 20 skins to make a bed and that will then allow me to sleep through the night otherwise I have to stay awake how am I doing in oxide I'm out of oxide so drop that in there and this literally is a stone age to be in did I hear a chamois There's a wolf over there, I can see it. Do I want to risk shooting him? There's an edible fish. No, he's gone, I can't see him anymore. Let's keep picking bits up at this point. What's up there? Something there. I can see the exclamation mark. It's another rabbit. And he's stuck in the water. Sorry about it. He got away. Uh, my mobile went. Um, damn it. <laughs> Problem with this game is you can't pause it. Ugh. If you press left control, you sneak. But he saw me. And if you sneak, you do double damage. Two and a half times damage. If they don't see you. You can shoot the animals in the water, but then you've got to dive into the water to collect them and harvest them. Which normally not too bad unless there's some poison fish around. So I'm wasting time here talking when I should be trying to get my XP up. Apologies. Um, it's going to be dark soon and I am not going to be able to see a thing. Because I don't even have a light. And it might be when I'm harvesting stone when I can't use it. I will be able to use it soon. And I can just turn it into stone piles. Which are useful for just sticking out the front of your base. They do offer minimum amount of protection. And I mean minimum amount. So there we go. I can craft that. Tart. Animal feed. No, I don't want that. This will overload me without a doubt. So six. Just place it down there. The night might just be taken up with um, harvesting wood and stone. If I can get a, lamp, uh, a torch, a wooden torch, which means I need to go up a uh, level to do that. Which is why I'm trying to desperately harvest all this wood stone. You get a lot more XP for killing animals and harvesting them, but um, obviously you've, you've got to find them to do it. See, it. the sun's going down. I can't see a thing, barely. I may have to pull the um, brightness up for you guys to see this. Nope, oh, that was my axe breaking. So I just got my inventory 
these axes, I just need stone to repair, and I've got stone on me. Just repair everything I've got basically here, make sure it's okay. Um, there we go, my axe is fixed, my pickaxe, sorry. Come on. Yeah, we got what I wanted. So, right, it's just uh, activate you so I can see what I'm doing. Got some meat that needs to be cooked. Right, um, tech tree. I want a, 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 a torch. Wooden rag torch, that's what I want. And I can do without that at the moment. Oh, basic water purifiers. Basic water purifiers, basic. Ah, okay, that's that's a new one for me as well. How many points have I got? Three left. I want that. I want that. What else do I want? I could probably do with that. You know what, I've not used one of these before, I'm going to try one of them. Talent points, I have one talent point, that's maxed out. Where's my health? Swift walker, strong shoulders. Actually it's this one, a dense packer. 5% capacity increase, so I can carry 105 kilos instead of 100. Okay, that's everything. So now let's make a torch. Uh, crafting, that's what I want. There's a torch, craft that. And there's a special slot. Let's move out a minute. Here, with the L against it for the torch. When you have something in there, if you press L, it lights up. You used to have to run around with it in your hand, but you can set yourself in your building a light with it. So that added this additional slot, which I thought was really useful. Okay, so. Now at least I can see what I'm doing. I mean, there's two reasons I'm clearing this stone. One, XP. The two it's in the, in the way. <laughs> I want to be able to build around here. And uh, this is currently right in the wrong place. And as you can see, it takes some um, clearing. And that's my stamina depleted again. How much stone do I have? Do I have enough to build another? Yeah, I do. Craft one of them. Put that down to number six. Press six. You can stack these on top of each other or side by side. Like so. That's enough to build. Build another uh, stone pile. And again, I think I get XP for building that. No, oh, maybe it's not. You do get XP for a bit crafting stuff normally, but it depends what it is. Um, what was that water thing I wanted to... Where was it? We need charcoal. Ten charcoal. How much charcoal do we have on our fire? As wood burns, Oops, don't want to do that. It creates charcoal. Uh, spit stack. I don't want to carry all this charcoal because it's heavy. I've now got a little basic water purifier, basic rainwater purifier. What is the difference? Let's craft both and find out. So six, that's a rainwater purifier. Seven is a water purifier. Must be placed in water. So when you play something you get this you click once and then you get this arrow so you can rotate it. Okay, so basic rainwater 
Purifier's got no leaders in it there at the moment. F to access, so fuel is charcoal. Okay, so the phone used for the charcoal. That's it, that's actually collecting water. What's the fuel for this one? Charcoal again, so let's take all the charcoal. Sorry, just had to turn the music off. I don't want to get a um, thingy strike, what do you call it? Um, I can't remember called strike for basic pub music playing anyway. Let's stick that in there, that will filter the water when it rains. Oh, I've just drunk some of the water out there by tapping F. By pressing and holding F, I can put more charcoal in there. And that will filter more water for me. Okay, that's a good way of getting fresh water early in the game. That never used to be there. So that's another positive change I've added. Looks like it's a shadow that was a bit of a stone there. Can I get it? There we go. So that's that stone gone. Um, how much stone do I have? 45. So not enough to build another um, stone pile. Okay, um, what else do I want to do? I want to craft. No, nothing. Bad weather coming in. Uh, storm incoming. Some more bad weather. So let's just, you know what? Can I craft some more wooden piles? No, I'm missing wood. Tyrannus says on those Tyrannus. It could kill me. <laughs> Oh, got it. By getting him in the head, you kill him really quickly. I was lucky it was sleeping. But no... No fur, which is annoying. However, it did give me a big boost to my XP. I was after a tree, wasn't I? Oh, I've got myself turned around here. Where's the water? Hold on a minute. Where am I? Well, there we go. Too easy to get turned around. Right. If your inventory is full, things will start going into your hot, uh, hot part at the bottom. And then when that's full, you just drop everything. Or you just drop anything new you pick up. You don't actually uh, put it in your backpack. So you can see the wood now just going straight into my hot bar. My base, there it is. Give me my base. We got another tree. Hopefully, you don't hit my base. Where'd that log go? That was there. Ooh, have I hit my base? I'm just trying to get as much of this done as I can before the storm hits uh, in anger. So I obviously need some more uh, wooden beams, or whatever it's called, wooden pillars to, I uh, just with my base, um, 
put the foundations on. Right. Let's see. Crafting. Let's go for three, six. And that will give us one, two, three, four of those, eight of those, and then walls. I need four. Um, see, oh Christ, that's a wind blowing the trees down, by the way. I'm crafting these things, but I've got no space in my inventory for them. So they're just falling on the floor. And it would be taking damage from the weather. So I need to... Uh, Come on, where are you? There. I need to uh, get these indoors and make these bases as quickly as possible. Did I? Yeah, I can make a crate. Let's make a crate. And then I can pick these bits up. Is in zero. Just stick them up against this wall for the moment. Left open it and then left click, uh, left control click to transfer stuff into it. And that will do. Okay. Bases. I only built two bases. I thought I built four. I'm gonna drop some more somewhere. No. Okay. Six. Which way are they going? That way. I need another two of those. Now walls, I've definitely built some walls. Um, six, press R, so I want to build a window this side. Um, I'm going to move my door over to here, I think. So I'll have a window there. Straight wall, straight wall. Um, to take something down, you come up to it and you press Y, and that will dismantle it. So six, uh, all there, bar, door, Y to take the door down, and then the actual door itself, oh, no oxygen, no oxygen, no, oh, um, inventory. Low food, food I can fix. Low oxygen is a problem. I need to find some oxide. There was some somewhere around here. I remember seeing it. Uh, that's sulphur. We'll use that later on for building better torches. Where does the oxygen? Come back to me again. Move to the side of my base. I uh, need to consume that as well. Myself a little bit more stamina. So has that got water in it? It's got 2.8 is of water because it's been raining. And look at all these trees that came down in the storm. It always, me, always amazes me how many trees come down in these storms. And um, yeah, how there's ever any trees left. I've got no idea. That's more sulphur. I don't want sulphur. I want oxide. Come on. 
There'll be some oxide somewhere. It's a deer running away from me. There we go. Oh, my axe is damaged. I'll quick repair that. And my stamina's damaged because I repaired my axe. Come on. I'm going dizzy because I've got no oxygen. How much does that give me? That give me 12, so stick that in there. That'll recover my oxygen a little bit, but I am going to have to get some oxygen when morning comes and see what the hell I'm doing. Close to my base here is down the trees. Yeah, there we go. And as I was going to say earlier, the door actually just fell off and fell on the floor. So, let's jump back up here. Six, and I just want that to be a normal wall. And then I can place my door in a new door frame. But now I'm missing this half my roof. You do get slanted roof parts like this, um, which make better roofs and corner pieces to fill in the gaps and things. But I think it take more to build. What's that? Um, 12 fibre, 20 wood, as opposed to 12 fibre, 20 wood, and it's the same. Okay. I could have just built a normal roof. But for now, that'll do. I've got a little cubby hole. Um, I should have put that the other way. Never mind. Activate you. I've got more meat to go in there. Let's have a slurp of water. What time of day is it? It's 3.30 in the morning. How uh, far am I? How far... Am I from going up another level? Not very. Let's just run around picking some bits up. Let's see if we can't get up a level. So as you can see, you do slowly deplete an area of stones and sticks and things like that. I think you do get some random spawning of some of this stuff. Um, but obviously the trees and things disappear. So these trees, I could do with chopping them up because they will disappear if I don't uh, chop them up. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to spend a little bit of time just chopping these up quickly. And turning them into the wood piles. At least that way I keep the wood before it disappears, otherwise it's lost. It'll just despawn and be gone forever. One tree gone. Christ, there's loads of them. There's three here.
So we've been um, cutting away, recovering the wood. I'm just about to make a stone, or a stone pile, a log pile. And because I had log piles in six, and I've got enough material in my inventory, if I just press six again, it will just build another one. As long as I've got the material in my inventory, it will do it. So again, I had 300 and something logs in there, or sticks in there, so just building another one. There we go, so I just emptied my inventory out a bit. Has that wood despawned yet? Yeah, it looks like the rest of the trees are just despawned. Shame. I nearly got all of them anyway. Yeah, they've gone. So I managed to rescue a good 80% of that wood of nothing else for despawned. But I have some more um, talent points to spend. Let's go and do that. What I'm going to do, because it's really annoying running up that um, slope every time, is build a little roof bit. Now these roof bits, when you go to place them, if you press R, you can select whether you want it to be a, an apex bit or just a normal uh, ramping roof with a Logs, the, the beams going up and down, normal uh, roof with the beams going left to right, or a ramp. And I want a ramp in this case. Press R, just turn direction there, so now I've got little steps going up into my base. And that just makes my life a little bit easier. Right, um, how are we doing? Did I put any oxide in here? No, I didn't. Alright, I'll let me build some more crates, because... Uh, you can now have enough storage. Ironically, you can also store wood in these crates. So that 68 wood can go in there, so up to 100. Oh, I took one because I was holding the key. Um, yeah, the 68. I could stick 10 stacks of 100 in there to get 1,000 wood in there, but yeah. Let's just get rid of some of these bits I don't need on me. I want some fibre on me. I've got quite a bit. I'm going to consume you. Yeah. And this is in a bit of the wrong place. So I can just X, press and hold X to pick up. Anything in it will drop out on the floor like such. And I just take all and pick it all up. And I'll put this crate so this one. And an F and just dump all this crap back in it. Got one of them. Don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. Oops. That. 100 sticks. Need that, don't need that, don't need that. Got some sticks, got some... So what I'm looking for is to try and have sort of basic stacks of the basic elements to build with. So that's bone, fibre, sticks stone, leather, and um, I think that's it, fibre, yeah, yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, wood is the other one, and I've got my wood piles here. Right, talent points. What do I want this time? One of these oxidizers, they produce more oxygen per um, block of oxide. Um, drying rack produces better meat. So look, I could get a shield. Don't really use shields to be honest. I'm not using them. Um, I could possibly do with a bandage. Okay, talent points. Um, I'm going to go both of them in this one again because it gives me an extra uh, lift carrying capacity. And solo, I've got any solo points? I've got one solo point. Um, and that's going in my health. Right, here comes the sun. So, that's day one over and done with. We've managed to uh, advance to a wooden hut with some stone tools and a bow and arrow. Uh, but we do have fire, which is a good thing. So I'm going to leave it there for now, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe. Comment below. 
any advice, tips, anything like that, it's gratefully accepted. If you'd like to support me more long term, I do have a Patreon page. But for now, Struggle by Gamer, wishing you good night.